Hi there, it's Sherry at Attic Inspire Crafter. Today I'm bringing you a short video on a tiny mini album and uh, we bring the mini album phrase to a whole new level with this little um, takeaway. So how this came about is a bit ago, a friend and I um, were able to participate in Pink Fresh's mall. Well, for us, it was our first event uh, virtually and it was their first scrapbook event so that was really lovely and we got this box of great goodies from them which we uh, created all weekend with but this little box came actually uh, one of the things that we got free for the weekend to take away some swag they like to call it is this is a stamp um, it helps with you pushing down on your stamp platform so that you can get a good inky image. And this was custom designed for that event. So each of the participants got to get one. And that is a fabulous piece of swag. And it has the pink fresh logo on there. I'm not sure if you can see it with the glare. I'll hold it up a little bit. Uh, it's gold in a soft pink. So it's very cute. So this came inside this box. So once I looked at the box, I got thinking, hmm, I can't throw away that box. It's just too cute. So this is what I created with it. So using their paper line, I decorated the outside of the box and just using some, some of the embellishments. So it's decorated all the way around and everything is used with a particular line from them and I'll post it in my blog what line it is but it is very cute these soft pastel colors are just absolutely fabulous and the box itself was white so it made for a fantastic drop for uh, this paper line and then I trimmed out using a die that I had from my stash just a black stitched frame for the window and then the little box itself decorated with the same paper all the way around and then this is where it gets to be interesting. So I couldn't have just a decorated empty box. Of course not. So what I did is I created this very mini. It is two and three quarters by two and three quarters because the box is three by three. And it has an itty bitty spine. And then there's the back. These are their uh, embellishments, I have to say, are quite different. They have a fabric feel to them, and this is a puffy sticker, so it is a little bit puffed up. And then a little butterfly from the line, and then it opens up. So I have no idea what this will be used for. Uh, I am going to the winter market here in Anaganish, and I'll have this as one of uh, an items for sale. When I was making it, I thought, what a cute box for a tooth fairy like a tooth fairy story and then the the children of the family can put their teeth in there and then they can go in in the morning and see what the tooth fairy left them so um and then you can journal in here that was just some of the thoughts that i had as i was doing this but you could use it for anything and there are three pages and each page has a little pocket you have to have pockets right uh and then each pocket has just this little cute piece of paper that you can do what you want with it. You can put on photos, you can do some journaling, and then each pocket is designed the same. A little album this size, you are limited to what you can put in there, so I try to utilize all of the space. And then each banner has just a sticker that you can journal something, a date or whatever you want. Treasure this moment. And then for the last one, another little pocket. So again, very quick walkthrough of this tiny, mini, very mini album. But I love how it turned out. And then it just fits. I have to put it this way so it will fit down. And then you just slide it into the box. And it has a little ribbon pull. And I just love it. I hope you enjoyed this and uh, you know nothing is wasted when you're into the paper crafting uh, club because every box that you get every envelope you get in the mail you just look at it through different eyes and you create things so uh, give me a thumbs up if you like this and let me know your thoughts thanks and have a terrific day